What's going on guys? Just John here with some more Mount and Blade. Warband. Uh, the previous character uh, dishonored herself pretty badly. Um, she thought that she could uh, train as well as lead uh, an entire village into battle. And they were slaughtered. And the entire village, village, the village... The entire village was burned to the ground. Uh, so she was executed. Um, and now we're moving on. Going to play a male character this time. I, 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 I failed pretty badly on that one. I think I had to uh, start over and start a new character. That was pretty bad. Uh, but we're playing a male noble and we've gotten the option now to choose a banner and that's kind of what I'm doing here I'm kind of looking for a banner that I, I get a pick so uh, that's kind of cool uh, oh I kind of like the Sun one that's cool what else um I'm thinking this one right here with the cross swords and the uh, the leaf or whatever. It's kind of red and black and those are kind of my colors right there. So I'm going to go ahead and, and go with that. Enter a new character name. I don't know. He's Greg. This is Greg. He's a... Uh, he's a strong, agile... And look, I got got to get some intelligence in there, right? Make him intelligent. There's Mr. Adam. He's not having a very good day today. I'm gonna put some in shield in athletics. Do prisoner management so I can take prisoners. Uh, also in trade, I got two more left. Um. Let me look here. What am I... Writing? I don't think writing is... Super important. Um, inventory management. Wound treatment. Let's see. Party healing speed is increased by 20% uh, per level. Uh, we'll do that. Surgery... Um, one more. I don't want to take. I don't want to take a lot of time here. Okay, let's we'll do that. We'll just do that. And then, um, little crossbows. Crossbows, and then we got two. Let's just do all crossbows. There we go. And we're done. And we'll go ahead and skip this and move on to right where we need to be. All right, we've arrived in uh, the Ro kingdom of Rodox in Jakala. Uh, exact same kingdom as last time. And now we got to, oh. How do I switch again? Oh, there we go. Um. There we go. Ah! Alright, we took him down. And I've improved my proficiency with the one-handed weapons to 75. Here comes the traitor. Running around all goofy-like. Uh, yes, we will take up his mission. Uh, he... What is this? His brother, right? It's his brother that was kidnapped. Um, yes. He got kidnapped by bandits. 
and we have taken up the quest. We're go we have to collect five men to go and rescue him. So that's what we need to do. We need to go. Was it here that I went last time? This was the village that was uh, burned to the ground by the bandits. We will go here and we will recruit volunteers. And there's one. Um, leave. We got one. We got a volunteer to join us in our in our crusade. And now we got to go to another village. I'm sure we'll go here. We'll go to Chelez. Let's go to Chalez. Here we go. I got my banner going. Flying my banner. There's some bandits right there. Some looters. They're going to try and cut me off. But they're not going to be successful. We'll recruit volunteers here. Oh my god. One? Ah. Uh... I got one. So I got three. I got an army of three right now. Let's go here to rule the rule die. Veluca. This looks like a big town. Let's go here next. And uh, we'll recruit. I can't go over. I can't go over the mountains. I have to go around them. What's this? Count Tribadans. Something or other. March 3rd, 1257. Oh, we got six. There we go. We got six now. We're ready. That's five. We got over five now. We got eight, right? So let's go back to Jakala. Nine of us total. We got enough to take on the bandits and to rescue the merchant's brother. And we need to visit the tavern, right? That's where he said he was. He said he'd be in the tavern. I don't know who that is. This is, this, this is him right here, right? Merchant of Jakala. Why don't you come with us? No, you don't have to do that. Uh, learn where the hostages are held. Okay. How do we do that? I'm not really sure. There's a band of robbers. Do we attack them? Uh, I've been looking for you. Here we go. There's Mr. Adam in the background. I'm not sure if you can hear him or not. He's making some noise. He's around hanging out. I've been I've been looking for you. Tell me where you keep your prisoners, and I'll let you go. I uh, know I'm bringing silver. I brought, I bought, I, I brought, I bought, I brought, no, but I brought steel. Um, we got to charge him. I'm going to go in with them. Of course I am. Let's go guys. Oh, I, I'm always on the horse. Uh, no, I don't want to retreat. How do I get off the horse? Stop the horse. How do I get off? There we go. Am I... I want my crossbow. Where's my crossbow? Oh my god, I forgot how to play already. Really? Alright. Sword it is. Um, how do I run faster? 
Okay, there they are. I got my men up there. There's four up front, and there's four back here with me. I should really be up there with them. We gotta get up here and get in this. Let's go, boys. Let's go, let's go, let's go. There's just one more left. We got him. We got him. Right? How many did we lose? Uh, we didn't lose any. Awesome. Enemy casualties. We got one killed. Uh, two wounded. Spare me. Spare my life. Let me go and I'll go far away from here and learn an honest trade and you'll never hear of me again. I'll spare your life, but in exchange, I want information. I want you to tell me where those kidnappers are. Where's the brother of the prominent merchant in Jakala? Tell me where you're hiding him and give me your word that you'll stop troubling the people of these parts and you can go free. Oh. Near Bouvran. All right. Okay, then. Greg is at 100%. Our morale is excellent. We've captured two looters. What does that mean? Well, what do we do with them? It already says that they're captured. Capture all. Oh, okay, okay. Captured enemies. And we've taken them prisoner. All right. Okay. We'll go ahead and take some of this stuff so that we can sell it. Well, maybe we won't. That one looks like it's worth a little bit more than the other things are worth. And that one's 17, so we'll go ahead and take that too. Oh, all right. And we got 19 dinars uh, for that. It says some soldiers are ready to upgrade and he says here's the kidnappers hideout let's go there we got nine of us I guess we're about to find out if that's gonna be enough there's mr. Adam hi buddy uh, we approached the hideout the looters don't appear to have spotted us uh, still sneak away unnoticed the difficult approach to the site down a narrow pile means that only a handful of troops in your party will be able to join the attack and they will be unable to bring their horses if your initial attack fails the looters will easily be able to make their escape and disperse do you wish to attack the hideout or wait for another occasion uh, no time like the present I'm sure the nine of us can, can all go I mean I don't have I don't have a thousand men, I just have nine. So, that should be fine. I think I missed. Come on. Come on. Oh my god, I have to go for this guy. Get out of the way. Oh, jeez. Disgraceful. Go with the sword. Let's go, guys. This one's mine. You got him? What do you got? A pitchfork? Guy looks like he's got a pitchfork. Who are you? I think we did it. It looks like we've won the battle. Did we lose anybody? There he is. With their retreat cut off, the looters fall one by one to your determined attack. <laughs> Hi, bud. Hi, buddy. 
Their hideout and their ill-gotten gains are now mine. Okay. Um, I think all the stuff I have is more uh, valuable than whatever their stuff might be. Oh, that was 105. We'll take that. We can take that. What else here? That's pretty good. 63. We'll take those. Those aren't that much. We'll leave those. A lot of woolen caps here. I don't think there's going to be much anything else. Stones. I don't know what those are for yet. Okay. Some soldiers are ready to upgrade. So, how do I do that? Oh. Um, ports, character, no. Party, duh. Party. Five are ready to be upgraded. We will upgrade three to spearmen and two to crossbowmen. All right. And. What can I do with the prisoners? I can talk to him. If you're running, running away or trying anything stupid, I will be watching you. He swears that he won't. Oh, okay, that's it. And that's that, I guess. Weekly cost, 25 Daenerys. I currently have 109. So I guess I got to go back to Jakala now. Is this where I drop my prisoners off? Um, visit the tavern. When I go talk to the merchant again. And he's paid me 200. I'm not sure what to do with him. Maybe pack him off to a university outside Colradia. That way, if he gets knocked on the head in the street brawl, no one can say it's my fault. All right. Remember? And I'm going to do another... He's, he's offered me another job here. Remember how I told you that the bandits had an ally inside the walls? I think I know who it is. The captain of the watch, no less. Some months ago, this captain, seeing the amount of profit we merchants that were making from trade across the frontiers, decided to borrow some money to sponsor a caravan. Unfortunately, like many who are new to commerce, he failed to realize that great profit only comes with great risk. So he sank all his money into the most expensive commodities and of course his caravan was captured and looted and he lost everything. As a consequence, it seems our captain turned to villainy to recoup his fortune. I suppose I'd do the same if the heavens forbid, if the heavens forbid, I ever faced indebtedness and ruination. Okay. Uh, now, any watch captain worth his salary will have a few thieves and robbers on his payroll to inform on the rest, uh, but our captain decides to employ these bastards wholesale. He brings them into town, lets them do as they will, and takes a share of their take. Uh, you've heard of poachers turning gamekeepers. Well, in the unfortunate land of Coloradia, 
sometimes gamekeepers will turn to poachers. Luckily, there are still a few brave, honest souls in the watch who've told me how he works. Holy God, do you like reading? I like reading. <laughs> now here's my plan. I could bring this to the attention of the king, but that would mean an inquiry. Uh, my word against the captains, of course, we don't want that. Uh, witnesses will be brought, will be bought, and evidence destroyed. Uh, blah 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 blah. Get a trouble knife. Yes, it's very dangerous to do that. He's got another idea, however, right? He needs to lead a little army into battle, and I can think of no, no one better than me. Uh, so what do I say? Uh, of course. How do I know you're telling me the truth? I suppose it's possible that... Holy God, reading. Well, I guess... Dun, 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 dun. All right. Let's go ahead and do it. Mm. All right. Now we're going to go do this. We're going to take care of a corrupted uh, a corrupted watch commander or something like that. Oh, my God. Really? Where's my sword? Oh my god. What am I doing? There it is. Oh, help me. Help me. Help me, army. I think I'm dead. I have fallen in battle. All right, I'm back. Sorry, guys. Mr. Kiddo is not having a very good day today. He's not in a very good mood. Uh, but anyway, I've fallen down. Uh, I'm trying hard not to pass out. I've, I've been defeated in battle. Um, and my men were able to succeed. So that's good. I suppose I should be more careful. Yeah. <laughs> All right. All right, guys. We'll uh, continue Mount and Blade Warband another time. Until then, peace out, guys.